the Macintosh PowerBook 1400 CS 1400C was introduced in October of 1996 and this continued in November of 1997. Announced in October of 1996, the PowerBook 1400 was a partial answer to a number of questions about recent PowerBooks. Powered by the same 117 MHz 603E as the 5300, the 1400 was the first PowerBook to include an internal CD-ROM drive 6-speed. The bay for the swappable drive could also accommodate a variety of other setting options including made-to-order and zip drives. The RAM came in stackable modules and another PowerBook first allowing up to 64 megabytes of RAM. The 1400 also included an internal expansion slot for video out or Ethernet cards and two PCI card slots that could accommodate two types of PC cards, PCI2 or one type of PCI3 card. Faster models with the small L2 cache and 8x CD-ROM drive were also released. This machine also came in a passive matrix which identifies the CS and also the active matrix which is the C model. This also has one ADB port, one serial port, one SCSI port 30 pin, one display optional mini 15 pin port, one infrared port, audio in, one 3.5 millimeter analog input jack, and one built-in microphone. Audio out, one 3.5 millimeter analog output jack, one built-in speaker. Expansion slots. This has two five and a quarter inch bays. Hard drive interface is an ATA2, which this particular model has been modified, a CF card reader drive. The power source on the system battery is a nickel hydrate metal battery, which has been rebuilt. I really enjoy this little power book, the 1400 CS. I have a lot of fun with it. And I hope you like this video. This has been my small contribution to the Marching Tosh for this year. So that being said, please like this video. Please subscribe and click that little notification bell for future updates. We're also on MeWe and Twitter. You can reach out to me uh, on Twitter. So you guys have a fantastic rest of your weekend. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.